welcome back. So I've got a fun little different haul for you today. This is going to be a fall fashion haul. And for the most part, I talk about makeup and beauty stuff on my channel, but I do occasionally talk about fashion stuff too because I really enjoy fashion. And for the most part, I'm a bargain shopper as far as clothing and shoes go. Um, I will occasionally invest in a nice pair of boots or um, a nice pair of jeans or something like that that I'm going to wear a lot. But for the most part, like all these things are from very affordable places like Forever 21, Charlotte Russe, Wet Seal, another store that's kind of like a Wet Seal in my area, and Target. So all really affordable stuff. Um, I just get so excited about the fall. It's my favorite time of year. The weather's nice. I love the makeup. And I love the fashion of this time of year, just like boots and jeans and flannels and sweaters and all those kinds of things. So I've been grabbing some stuff lately, so I thought I would just pull it all together and do a fun little haul for you. So let's just jump into it. Okay, so the majority of this stuff is going to be from Target, so I'm going to go over all the other stuff other than Target first. Okay, so first off, I was really wanting like some stuff to be able to do that sort of 90s grunge look where you have a printed top underneath and then like a flannel over it. I think that's so cute and just, I don't know, trendy and fun. So I did find a couple of things to be able to do that. So the first shirt, this one is from Forever 21. It says, live as far as your dreams will take you. I really like that. Um, I like the kind of longer sort of open arm thing. You know what I mean? <laughs> um, but yeah, I really like that. I think it's cute. And I think that will be great to go under something. This one was, this is from Forever 21. This is $15.90. And then I found this shirt, it says The Stones in Concert. Um, I really like classic rock, so I thought that was super cute. There's like cat hair and me hair on this. And I haven't even worn these yet, so they've just been hanging. So how would they have cat hair on them? Andy, why you do that to me? <laughs> this was $15.92. Um, and I just thought it was really cute. So... That one will go under some other things. And then to go over that, I found this flannel at Wet Seal. I thought it was really cute. So it's kind of gray with like pink in it. Um, I was really looking for something more solid, or not really solid, but more kind of muted colors that I could wear with a bunch of different things. But I really don't mind that this has pink in it. I think it's kind of fun. This one was $26.90, but then I think the store was like buy one, get one for $10 or a dollar or something like that. So I also got this shirt. I've already worn this one, so I don't remember. For both of these, I think it was like 30 something dollars for the um, flannel and then also this one. Uh, I wore this to one of the makeup show events. So a couple of these things I've already worn, but most of it I have not. Um, so I just think this is so cute, like a kind of florally top. And I really like these kind of um, material, this kind of material in the fall because Texas is, it's still really hot here. So our fall isn't really cold. So these are perfect for this time of year. So yeah, I thought those were really cute. And then from that local boutique, I wanted to go ahead and show you the pieces. I know you won't be able to find these exact pieces because it's a local boutique, but um, maybe you can kind of get some ideas for things that you might want to look for in your area. And it's not like this is even all that difficult to duplicate or all that exciting because it's an oatmeal sweater, but <laughs> I really like pieces like this because they're great for really getting creative with them. You can get really creative with your jewelry and have chunky jewelry or colorful jewelry. You can have patterned leggings because this is a long sweater. Um, you can have really intricate boots. Um, just really, I don't know, just getting creative with everything else you do with the outfit with a basic piece like this. And it's got kind of like a, an eyelet pattern on the back, so I really like that. Um, and it's just cozy and comfy and basic. I love it. So this one was $21.20, so I really like that. And then, oh my gosh, this skirt. Look at this. It's a pencil skirt, and it's like an acid wash pattern. I love it. Oh my gosh. I want to find a really cute pair of acid wash jeans. And I haven't found like the pair, you know what I mean? So I just kind of keep looking every time I'm in Wet Seal or Charlotte Russe or something like that for something that would be that kind of acid wash, really cute, basic pair of jeans. But this is so cute. I almost wore this to the makeup show, but um, it was freezing in there, so I wore pants. Um, it's just really cute. It's flattering. I got it um, in the next size up for me because the other one was like 
really tight and I don't know. I felt a little on display because it was a very tight pencil skirt. I just like, you know, I wanted it a little bigger. So I got a little bit bigger. Um, but I just love it. I think it's so cute. And this was $27.90, which is more than I normally spend on a piece of clothing typically. Um, especially for something like this that's kind of trendy. But I don't know. I thought it was so unique that I really, really liked it and wanted to get it. And then from Charlotte Russe, I got a few things. So first off, this shirt, um, I wore this to the makeup show on Saturday. I thought it was really cute. I don't, it doesn't still have its um, price tag on it anymore, but it has a little kind of, it's not a real zipper, it's a fake zipper on the back. But I just think that's really cute. Um, it's kind of longer, which is also cute. I think this was like $13.99, so around $14, which is awesome. And I just really like that it's colorful and floral and cutesy. That's how I describe it. It's a cutesy shirt and I like cutesy. So I got that and then I got um, these two pieces to wear together. These are some little patterned. I think this looks so 90s. I feel like I had a dress that had some kind of like daisy or sunflower sort of floral pattern on it. Something like that. I, I had some kind of a dress like that in the 90s. So this is kind of like nostalgic for me. I thought they were really cute. Um, and they were, no, they're marked twelve ninety nine, but they rang up $8, which was awesome. So I got those, and then I got just a basic black top to wear with them. It's longer, um, and I wanted to be able to really cover up my booty, because I'm really big on that with leggings. It has to really almost be like a dress on me, whatever I wear with leggings, because a lot of times they're kind of see-through, so we don't, no, 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 mm -mm, none of that. So, <laughs> so I got this one, um, and it's just a basic flowy black top, so I thought those were so cute, but those leggings are just so 90s and just kind of brings me back. And then now on to all the Target stuff. So the first thing is this really cute Superman sweater. It's just a, you know, a basic comfy cozy sweater, but it's got the Superman symbol on it or the shield. Um, my husband is a huge Superman fan, so he loves it when I wear Superman stuff. He thinks it's really cute. So, you know, I gotta impress my man with wearing superhero, <laughs> superhero attire. So I had to get this sweater. I thought it was just comfy, cozy, and cute and fun. It was $16.99 and it's really, really soft too. So I'm definitely gonna wear this as one of my just comfy, cozy sweaters, but also to look cutesy for my man. And then I got this exhilaration sweater that I thought was really cute, just this kind of like animal print. Um, and I like sweaters like this because you can still wear this to work um, and look pulled together and nice, but it's still cutesy and trendy as well. Um, and this one's, it's not a long sweater, but it's not really a cropped sweater. So it's kind of like right to your waistline, which I really like. And it's soft and comfy. Um, this one was $16.99, so really affordable. And just, I love that pattern. I think it's so cute. I like, and I like the gray, that kind of like darker gray look. That's really cute. And then I got a couple of these um, sweaters or these flannels or whatever you call them. These were on clearance, which was awesome. And they've got the little um, different patchwork on the elbows, which I think is so cute. So this one's just a black and white one. I think these were, um, let's see, what are they marked? I think they were 16, 1608 on clearance. So I thought that was really cute. I love the black and white one. Again, I could wear that one. I got that one after I bought the one at Wet Seal. So I can still wear that one over some of those pattern tops and get the 90s grunge look at, with that as well. And then I got this one, the kind of red and blue. I love this one with the patchwork on this on the arm. I mean, how cute is that? I love that it's totally different than the um, plaid. I love that it's striped. So I thought that was so, so cute. I was trying to decide between this one and they had a green one. And I don't know if y'all do this, but I take pictures of myself wearing clothes. If I'm trying to decide between certain things, like I'm like, no, I'm only getting one. I will try on both of them, take a picture, and then flip back and forth and decide. And so actually looking in the picture, I liked this one better. So that's a little tip if you're having trouble deciding what you want to get, or if you even like it at all, take a picture of yourself and look at it. And for some reason, it's different than looking in a mirror. Random. And then finally, I got some accessories. So they were having um, buy one, get one half off on their handbags a while back. So I got, um, first off, this this one right here. This is like a crossbody bag. 
and it's got the long strap, but you can also like adjust it for how long you want it to be. But I really love this kind of camely color, and I know that it's plastic, but I don't know, like I feel like it almost maybe kind of looks like leather. I don't really know. I don't care if it looks like leather or not. Plastic's totally fine with me. But I just really like the color and I like that it is bendy and you can, it really fits a lot too. I wore this to the makeup show and it really worked perfectly because I could fit quite a bit in it, but it was easy to wear and still small and compact. And then I got this purse. I've got all my junk in it right now, so it's heavy. Um, but I really like this one. It's got like a zipper in the middle and then it's got two little sections that like pop open with a button. So I really like that. I love the hardware on it. I think it's so cute. And this color is different than I would normally go for. I've never really gone for these kind of like taupey gray colors, but I just thought it was something different. And I do like that this purse is pretty light when you don't have your stuff in it. I hate when purses, even before you put anything in them, they're already heavy. I hate that. So. This is pretty light, which I really do like. Now I have a lot of junk in it now, so it's getting weighed down. But before I put all my crap in it, it was pretty lightweight, which I really like. And I do really enjoy the color of it and the hardware on it. And for some reason, I have an obsession with boots. Every year, I get so excited about looking at the new styles and what's out. I don't need any more boots. But every year, I go look, and I'll usually grab one, maybe two pairs. Um, but a lot of times, they're from Target, so they're affordable. Um, I don't know, I just get so excited about boots. And when I do get new pairs, I do wear them. So that's the good thing. I don't just buy them and they don't just sit there in my closet. I do really wear them and love them. So the first pair are these really adorable rocker moto boots. I stinkin' love these. I love the studding on them, the like little fake zipper there. They do have a zipper to get them on and off, which I really love, so they're easy to wear. Um, and they're just adorable. Like, I would wear these to a concert. I would wear them to dinner with my husband. Um, I can wear these to Sephora, which is really fun. And they're just cute. And they're basically flat, so they're really comfortable to wear. And I just love them. I, I bought a pair of Moto boots last year that were pretty basic, and I wore them a lot. So I really think I'm going to get a lot of use out of these, too. So these were $36.99. Stinkin' love them. And then I got this pair. Oh my gosh. I totally missed the boat on this one because Sarah, my friend Sarah from Beauty Buzz Hub, put something about this on her Instagram and I waited on it. They were on sale when she was talking about them and I missed the sale, but I had to go back and get them just because they're so adorable. So when I bought them, they were $37.99. I mean, look at the buckle detailing on them. They look kind of worn on the toes. And I like that they're kind of this like taupey gray color, like kind of the color of that uh, purse that I got. <gasps> I just love them. I love that they look worn and kind of old and they still have a little bit of the rocker look going with the um, buckles on them. And again, they have the zipper, so it makes them easy to get on and off. So oh, these are so cute. All right, guys, so that's everything I picked up recently as far as fall fashion goes. So I hope that you really enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and let me know what your favorite fall fashion things are. Do you love boots? Do you love flannels? What kind of things do you love pairing together in the fall? I want to hear your thoughts and suggestions. Ask me any questions you have down below. I'm happy to answer those. Please subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.